AMC Stock A Short Seller's Nightmare is the title of the first one, and it examines the numbers that are behind AMC 100,000 in order to demonstrate that it is achievable. Prior to delving into those, however, I would want to extend a heartfelt thank you to the 1,200 of you who have already rung that notification bell. You guys are always the first to see a new video as soon as it is uploaded, so if you haven't already, please make sure to subscribe to the channel and ring that notification bell. This will ensure that you don't miss any other videos that are similar to the one you are currently watching. Good luck. First things first, let me begin with the hype video for AMC. We had outstanding results, and the stock price even went up after we reported that we had been the target of some short selling despite the fact that we had been successful. To put it another way, we are effectively stating that this corporation is unable to pay off its debt and will eventually fail to meet its financial obligations. I have noticed that the media has been portraying investors who have devised their own techniques for the stock market in a negative light over the course of the previous few weeks. The fact that a significant number of retail investors have regularly stated that they intend to buy AMC Gain 95 is one of the elements that makes this situation amusing. This is Friday, June 25th, and retail is winning media that we are wagering against the apes in half for freaking decades and decades of film. This is taking place in the retail industry. This is something that I wanted to bring to your attention because we are already getting close to the market. Since the previous Monday till now, we have reached a total of 419, and at one point today, we reached a total of more than 500. Now, let's get started with the articles from the news. When it comes to short sellers, AMC stock is a nightmare for those who sell to them. This year, the community on Reddit has been unable to get a good night's sleep because of their determination to stand united against AC shorts. This has prevented them from getting a good night's sleep. Since the year 2021, bears have endured a significant amount of pain and suffering. The epic battle that took place between an ape and a suit is currently the topic of discussion among Wall Street users. Acme stock has been one of the most talked about subjects in the stock market throughout the course of this year on account of its performance. Due to the fact that there have been two massive squeezes, it has climbed by 2,200% so far this year. Given the current state of affairs, it would appear that the disagreement between investors and short sellers in Acme is not even close to being addressed. Even though Acme stock has just witnessed a drop of 27% from its peak in the middle of June, short sellers have not given up on the stock. In fact, they are far from giving up on the firm. At least for the time being, Acme investors are outperforming their peers. Do you believe that Acme has the ability to reach the moon in the future, regardless of whether certain individuals desire $100 per share or $100,000 per share? The insanity starts to subside. The information that was given by Yahoo Finance indicates that there are roughly 17 short positions at the American Corporation. The number of short positions held by Ortex, on the other hand, is closer to 19 and indicates that $4.8 billion are held in short positions. Ortex has a bigger number of short positions than any other company. Over the course of the month of June, investors who were shorting shares of Apple, Inc., experienced a loss of $2.8 billion. The United States stock that was the one that had the greatest damaging effect on people who were shorting it was this particular stock, which came in third place behind Apple and Tesla. Since they have lost almost $3 billion on Apple, Inc., $1.3 billion on Tesla, and a great deal more, it is evident that short sellers have had a very dismal year. This can be seen by the fact that they have lost a lot of money. In order for the next positive wave to materialize, it is necessary for eight to have a strong shareholder wall in order to counterbalance the influence of paper hands and institutions that continue to maintain short positions. Capital will be required in order to compensate for the probable short-term losses that may occur in the near future. Apes have an advantage over short sellers in order to keep up with short sellers, and this advantage will allow long sellers to keep up with short sellers. During the past few weeks, short sellers at AMC have experienced a slight sense of relief as a result of the large decrease in the share price that has occurred since the middle of June. This does not change the fact that short-term interest rates are still rather high and are continuing to climb. When compared to individual investors, institutional traders typically have larger reserves, which can be advantageous in terms of mitigating any potential weaknesses that may occur. On the other hand, apex predators exhibit an unshakable devotion to their cause, even if it means sacrificing market share in order to achieve their goals. Therefore, despite the recent decrease in the stock market and the bullish forces that have been placed on it, it is quite possible that the conflict is not yet concluded as long as there is a considerable level of short interest in the company. This is because the stock market has been experiencing negative prices for quite some time. 
The fact that this is the case means that there is a possibility of another short squeeze, which is something that we have been discussing throughout the entirety of this conversation. All right, so this is the topic that we have been talking about for a considerable amount of time now when all of the short positions have been filled, the squeeze will not stop until it has been completed. What would occur, on the other hand, if the stock was managed to reach a price of $100,000 a share? According to the upcoming episode of Apex Jokes on Wall Street, which will explore the matter, Wall Street may place wagers on eight different sites. In order to get a better understanding of how AMC 100,000 might be attainable, there are a number of hashtags on social media that are associated with the stock of the company. These hashtags indicate that the expectations are for the company to achieve a price of $100,000 per share, if not higher. A great deal of optimism for AC shares, which have been the most successful meme stock up to this point in the year. In theory, one must first toss aside business fundamentals, and guys, that's the important part. This squeeze isn't based on fundamentals. It's a short squeeze play that being said the price of a stock is determined on supply and demand forces at the margin, in other words, how much AMC can be traded for. Depends on how much buyers are willing to pay for such shares and how many of them are in the market, but not only that if shorts get squeezed and liquidated, they have no choice but to buy the stock back. It doesn't matter if they don't want to, they're getting liquidated, you don't have an option, you. Don't have a decision in the say when you get liquidated, for example. Let's say in November or December or December or January you want to short Bitcoin with 100 times leverage and it blew up in your face, you can't just go to your broker and say, hi guys, can I please have my money back? I didn't mean to do that. Like you don't get the choice in the matter. If buyers overwhelm sellers and a trade can be executed at a price of $100,000 voila, that's pretty much what it takes for magic to happen, but in practice pushing a stock price this far would require overwhelming demand for AMC a wave of extremely loyal and united diamond hand. Holders willing to pay well beyond reason for the stock they would then need to maintain their long positions and not succumb to selling pressure from traders looking to gobble up their attendees. But what they don't realize is that is exactly what we have. We have overwhelming demand. We have a wave of extremely loyal and united diamond head holders. And we're going to hold the stock forever until all the shorts have covered. I would appreciate it if you could share your thoughts on that inspiring movie with me in the comments section below. Also, please let me know what you believe AMC stock will perform in the following week. You can visit the Patreon link that is mentioned in the description below in order to receive news updates and background checks similar to this one before I ever make a video. If you have not already done so, you can do so by clicking on the link. If you are interested in purchasing shares in AMC for the following week but have not yet registered for a trading platform, you can access free trade if you are based in the United Kingdom or Weeble if you are located in the United States by using the links that are provided below. In order to acquire free shares, the minimum deposit that is necessary is merely 200 pounds, which is comparable to $2,300. Both of these alternatives have unusually low minimums. If you found this video to be enjoyable, I would be grateful if you would also consider watching some of the other films that I have created. You also have the option to click the bell and subscribe to the channel in order to receive notifications whenever I upload a new video. For more information, click the bell.